What is your full name? Um, my full name is Doug Edward. You can call me Peter, my patient. And where are you from? I'm from Washington City, which is a very good More than city. I'll be a Do you work or are you a student or both? I'm a student in the high school. Uh, we talk about transportation. Now, uh, what journeys do you make every day? Um, I have not much journeys. Uh, I have one to school and another one to get back. How far is it? About two kilometers. How do you do? How do you do that? Sorry. Right. How do you get there? Um, I get there by well, like, my phone. Cross the river. Uh, have you ever traveled by plane? Yes, I have. I have many times traveled by train. Well, Where to, for example? Um. Mostly, I fly to my hometown, where I went How far is it? About a thousand kilometers. By Hanoi? No, in the central. Central? Mm. Okay, have you ever gone anywhere to see animals? Mm. Once then, um, I remember that it was on the day of the day and my parents took me to the zoo and I saw it and it was there. Any particular ones that you remember? Any particular animals that you remember at the zoo? Uh, peacock. Peacock. I um, it's really, it's been really beautiful with their taste. Okay, would you like to work with animals? Uh, maybe I want to be a uh, care. Veterinary? Yes. Okay. Uh, Okay, that's the end of part one. Now we'll do part two. I'm going to give you a topic and you will talk about it for one to two minutes. Uh, here is the topic and here is a pencil and paper to take notes. So you prepare to speak about this topic. And you can start preparing now. You have one minute to prepare.
So you are going to talk about a place you enjoyed as a child? Uh, when I was a child, my parents are always busy, and my sister lives there, and I go, so I used to spend time alone. I like playing in my playroom. Uh, so I can say my playroom is where I <clears throat> usually came when I was a child. The playroom is on the second floor next to my bedroom and opposite to my parents' room. Uh, it always full of toys and stuff where I play um, some of my special things. Um, it had four windows and a main door, so it full of light and wind. So I didn't need to turn on the air conditioner. Um, the room was super big, so I um, can, could do many activity there. And the thing I liked most in was giant attack the city. Uh, that means I became a child, attack the city, which is built from Lego. Uh, I play some sh shoulders, some tanks, or dragon. Uh, on the road or on the skyscraper. You were running out of time. Anything that anything you'd like to say? On the skyscraper. Uh, and when I play in the room, I lost my awareness of time. Uh, you lost what? My awareness of time or anything else. Uh, for instance, what? Okay, that's all the time. Okay, one more. Biden. Okay, you have. What are the most popular free time activities with children today? Uh, I think children today prefer to play game to do anything else, so they play games any anytime, not just on their free time. How do you think children's activities will change in the future? Uh, as I say, the children prefer playing games or playing on laptop, smartphone, uh, to read books or do something to improve their skill. So. In the future, the technology will develop uh, so much and their activity will change in a positive, positive way. What do you enjoy doing in your free time? I enjoy reading books. Uh, to, uh, now I I'm reading a book called um, Space in the Shell. It's really good. It's a book of um, Einstein. Oh, okay. Einstein. Okay, thank you. That's all. You can take your notes.